Here at home, renters at the Point Apartments in Plymouth were forced out of their homes weeks ago. And tonight, the city issued an order to vacate the building after officials declared the structure dangerous. And now residents are scrambling to find a permanent place to live. Walid Alamla visited Plymouth today and joins us here in studio. Walid, what have you learned? Yeah, guys, the residents of the Point Apartments have had to deal with their fair share of issues over the weeks. Electrical currents running through the building, a leaking roof, even being and even being displaced from their homes and the issues continue to be up in the air. The roof is horrible. I literally have a kiddie pool in my bedroom just to catch water. 18 residents here at Point Apartments have been displaced after Plymouth officials received a complaint regarding unsafe building conditions back on July 12th leading to an investigation. Reached out to the Marshall County Health Department. We came in as a joint effort to investigate. Um, there was some a lot of a lot of issues with the roof leaking. There's some other hazards. Those hazards include electrical issues like active currents running through the building, a danger that has already affected some residents. One of the residents was shocked. I, I, and I witnessed that she was, the AC unit was arcing and she went to find a place to turn it off. And when she did that, she stepped in the water and it gave her a shock. She was l very lucky that it didn't hurt her any worse than it did. The electrical issue was fixed by the owner of the property, but roofing issues ultimately led to the closure on July 12th. And unfortunately, when I came back to do the roof inspection to see if it was good, found some soft spots. They had opened the roof back up, and with the roof opened up, I can't allow people to stay here and live in here. And the residents are staying here at the Days Inn with help from the city, United Way, and Link to Hope. But unfortunately, their time is running out. We have to check out Thursday morning, and they're talking about trying to put us in these other hotels. We've been, it was two weeks Sunday we've been here, so two and a half weeks staying here. And this is like being uprooted. I don't care where your home is. You, this is not our home. This is a hotel. I also spoke with Mayor Robert Listenberg, and he told me that these issues could be a months long problem. The city is recommending residents look for long term housing as the owner decides if the repairs will be made. Man, Walid Alama reporting on an unmitigated mess in Plymouth tonight. Thank you, Walid.